Hi folks, my name is Craig Johnson. I'm the owner and operator of CJ's Canine Retreat and Dog Lodging. Uh, we're located 10 minutes east of New Richmond, Wisconsin. Uh, what we, I'm a 90, 1993 graduate of National Canine in Columbus, Ohio, um, with Scott Mueller's school, school in Ohio. We specialize in a unique form of lodging where we take, take dogs in and a lot of them come right into our household, stay right in the house with us while they're there. Um, and we re also rehabilitate dogs with different issues. We put together just a brief video to show some of the different techniques we use and some of the fun we have on a daily basis here at CJ's. Uh, you will, you'll see Hope, a German Shepherd that we rehabilitated. You'll see some utility work with her, police canine type work over logs. And sh uh, she came from a, a bad background and we rehabilitated her and countless other dogs you'll see in the video we actually rehabilitated for people and then uh, some actually adopted ourselves and they've, they, we work with them to train new dogs that come in at this time. So um, just a short video to show you some of the fun we have with my family, my wife Julie, my kids Ethan and Paris, and my brother-in-law uh, Tyler. You'll get to see a little water work with the gun dog stuff we do. Um, just a little brief video for the fun of it to show you guys what we do on a daily basis here at CJ's Canine Retreat. Hope you enjoy the video. All right, this is Hope, the German Shepherd. I, I briefly hit on over at the intro. This She's a year and a half years old, and we did extensive rehabilitation with her. She came from a, a really shady background as far as um, uh, men would tease her, trying to get her to look aggressive and mean, um, which sometimes can be common with the more high caliber working dogs like this. Um, and then we've had her for like a, just a, briefly over a month now. And Ethan's played a large role in the rehabilitation as far as exercising her and helping me get her used to uh, males, mainly males. And uh, she got teased also by a small, three small dogs. So we rehabilitated her, rehabilitated her with small dogs also that we'll show you in part of the video. But um, I'm just gonna show you some exercise work with Ethan, my son, and Paris, my daughter, with Hope. A lot of people don't realize that one of the most important things you can do for your dog is give them a job especially a working dog like a German Shepherd um, and they live in the moment and that's why she was able to be rehabilitated so quickly is we gave her a job here at CJ's. So this mimics protection work, police work and or drug detection which is what they were originally bred for herding but uh, they've been used for so many decades as far as earthquake search and rescue stuff like that 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 was the perfect job that we could give her and she came out of her shell almost immediately after having all right, now we're gonna have Ethan do some bike work with her. Here's Ethan cruising pretty good towards the camera. Here comes the fun part I was talking about. If it ain't fun, you're not gonna train, so Ethan scary. thinks this is really fun. All right, now I'll go back this way, buddy. Yeah, people are surprised at that, Ron, how fun this can be. You don't understand that, but how fun that this exercise and uh, discipline part can be. Nice correction, Ethan. You can see how he uses the, the tire in the correct way. Um, in a humane way, but to make sure she stays clear of those tires so you don't have an incident. <laughs> Here comes the speed. <laughs> Draining that physical energy again. That's nice. Good job. That's perfect. Now we're doing those walks I was talking about, Ron, where we, countless times a day we'll take them out on walks. Because it's one thing to have them in the dog run where they're running free and playing, interacting that way with the tennis ball, for example. But I always want to stress that control, and this is what develops that bond and that control is uh, the mastering the walk, we call it. Like Caesar Milan talks about mastering the walk. And that was Tyler with uh, Tippy, who we've been training for gun dog work, but we apply all that same training uh, into everyday uh, life for companionship also. Once again, like a typical day here at CJ's. And that's why it doesn't seem like work to me, but it's really fun related and the dog sense that. Hey Paris, once again, uh, mo the majority of the calls I get for, for my in-home lessons and the dog training are the same. It's the same calls over and over. A lot of it's... Uh, like I said earlier, they can't walk dogs. Larger breeds of dogs, stronger dogs that, like the Malmute, for example, this is Toke, Toke in Paris. 
um, just kind of giving you a demonstration how um, it's not the size and strength of a person. Paris is 11 years old. All right, go that way, Paris, now in a big circle. And just show the control of walking a sled, a strong Malmute sled dog, that you can get that control if you master the walk. And next, I'm going to have Paris have, do a toss from out there. Scout, mark it. Then once again, just waiting to make sure that you got that steadiness that we're after. I'll put her in a down position. Down. That's something that we like to work on year round is that steadiness, as opposed to two weeks before the season starts. Here we are in, what, what's the date? It's uh, end of July now, and we're already working on that steadiness, actually year round, so that you're not working on control the last minute. So I'll have her sit there for a minute, a few minutes actually, get steady and then send you. Back, back, let's go. She was waiting for the right command. Let's go. Let's go. Hold it. Good girl. Heel. Good girl. Fetch it up. Fetch it up. Here. Good girl, Tip. All right, that wraps up our video. Thanks for joining us um, in today for at CJ's Canine Retreat. Just a brief, this is my daughter, once again, Paris, that helps out every day. And in the background, you see my wife, Julie, uh, son, Ethan, and Tyler, my brother-in-law, who all get involved at CJ's, helping out every day with uh, different things we do. We do the unique lodging. Um, we also do the in-home lessons. Once again, when I come to your home and do in-depth lessons one-on-one -on -one with you um, for things, everything from dog aggression to fear issues uh, to basic things like walking on the leash correctly. And then at our place, Paris does a lot of socialization with dogs, rehabilitation, and just um, a lot of love and attention each day at the, at the canine retreat for, for CJ. So hope you enjoyed the little video. Say bye, Ethan. Bye. And Paris. Thank Thanks you. again.